<laughs> and you had the good sense to wear an undershirt today, unlike Michael Conforto. Oh, man. Hey, Mets fans, we did it again. Woo! Oh, man. I tell you what, this team has no quit. We were grinding all game. You know, Pleco, he did a great job today. He makes him have a lot of pitches. We got into their bullpen and we were just grinding them out. We got hand up there, one of the best closers. We just passed the baton. Uh, we had that New York swagger, that New York attitude. We didn't quit. We didn't quit. Oh, man. Well, you said it three times right there. You guys did not quit and you guys haven't quit as of late. What is the feeling in this dugout amongst these guys when you fall behind again there? Oh, it's rare. Uh, we get excited. We don't get bit down. We got down early in the season, but this time around the second half, something clicked. And every time we get down, we get excitement because we know we're going to have moments like these. Something clicked for you, especially in the second half. You've had a great season, but you're leading the NL in batting in the second half. What specifically have you been doing so well during this stretch? Uh, it's just a mental thing of getting the ball out in front. Uh, you know, those last four at-bats before I was catching everything too deep, Chili told me to, hey, get your sights out in front, get something out in front, and then just let something happen, you know? <laughs> Something happens seemingly every night. J.D. Davis, first career walk-off. Congratulations. Enjoy. Hey, thank you very much. Let's go, Mets! Gary, he's excited.